I wanted to talk today about um, travel counseling. A lot of Americans uh, uh, take vacations or sometimes business trips abroad. Sometimes we forget about our destination itself. We get so busy and caught up in packing and preparing for the actual logistics of the trip that we sometimes forget the unique cultural and geographic um, environment that we're actually going to. and We may not know very much about it. And so being prepared to guard one's health so you can have a safe and healthy trip, I think is very important. Vaccines or uh, medications that one can use uh, or receive before going abroad to certain countries that might have certain diseases or viruses or vectors that are endemic to that area. And so uh, this is really about prevention and preventive medicine. And prevention is the best medicine. Yeah. Many parts of South America, Africa, South Asia, um, malaria is still a huge concern um, carried by uh, a mosquito um, in more humid, often rural or lower elevation uh, geographic areas. And uh, malaria can cause a very acute illness, febrile illness. You can be pretty sick, very feverish, and it can just totally ruin your vacation or trip. And so there are medications that you can talk to your doctor about. Uh, you can make an appointment, or sometimes um, the counties have local uh, health clinics as well that carry travel uh, advice or travel clinics. Um, but speaking with your doctor would be a great place to start uh, to make sure that you're protected with the appropriate medications before uh, going abroad to a specific country. Some other uh, diseases or illnesses uh, that one can contract uh, while abroad are uh, very common to see traveler's diarrhea, other infectious diarrheal uh, illnesses, dengue fever, um, yellow fever, Sometimes through contaminated food, if one is a uh, experimenter and goes to a rural area, uh, uh, sometimes hepatitis A can be contracted. And many of these uh, illnesses, again, are very preventable, preventable with uh, vaccines or medications, antibiotics in some cases. It only takes one mosquito or uh, one exposure to uh, get a potential awful illness or uh, sickness. And so even if you're just going for a few days, I think it's still very important to uh, be alerted of what's out there and to be prepared going forward. And again, uh, scheduling an appointment with your primary care physician would be a great place to start to talk about these things.